Today at Keystone Fence Supply Company, we'll be doing a quick overview of Outlast Q8 log oil and how it can be applied to your end cuts on the fence line. Q8 log oil is sold in bulk five gallon containers or a more portable and easy to handle one gallon container. The preference for installing this product is in a spray bottle. So we just picked up a heavy duty sprayer at the local hardware store and used our one gallon jug to easily fill that up. And now we can bring that out to the fence line and do application with the squeeze of a trigger. This product can also be brushed on with a brush or just dumped directly onto the end cut of lumber. Q8 log oil sprays on clear and dries clear with no bright colorings or discoloration of your lumber. Simply spray on until completely saturated and your post tops or end cuts have been protected. If you're building a fence and you have to make a end cut, a mortise, or cut the post tops, you need to make sure to thoroughly spray with Q8 oil to seal up and prevent rotten decay on the top of your post. Q8 log oil is an approved method for sealing and protecting pressure treated lumber when saw cuts are made into the timber. This product is toxic to termites and powder post beetles and will help prevent rot and decay on lumber products. We sprayed this post top approximately 15 minutes ago and as you can see it is already drying clear and does not look like any product has been applied although it is protected and sealed against rot and decay. The coverage rate on Q8 log oil is approximately 150 to 300 square feet per gallon. This can vary depending on application rate, how dry your wood is, or how quickly the timber that you are applying it to absorbs the product. As you can see, it has dried clear and presents a natural finish to your timber product. If you do not have a sprayer handy, you can also simply dump the product onto the lumber straight from the bottle. Apply liberally until the point of saturation. Q8 log oil is an essential product, not only when building fence, but when working with any pressure treated lumber where end cuts were made. Remember, if you cut into pressure treated lumber, you want to seal up the sawn area to prevent rot and decay and seal the exposed saw cut area. This product is great for log homes, wood roofs, wood decks, siding, and fences. Give Keystone Fence Supply Company a call at 717-949-8170 to order your product today.